Peggy 7. The idea to bring back Gigantic uh, began when we knew that there was a community that existed in the background. We knew that they were talking about it through Discord, through Reddit. I'm excited to finally share that we're going to be bringing back Gigantic with our development team, Abstraction Games. When I first heard Gearbox publishing folks um, told me that um, they were working on a reboot of Gigantic, I was very, very excited. I love the amount of new heroes that's coming into the game and also the rush mode, which was something that we internally at Motiga discussed, but never really got to finish. And that's in, in the new game. Uh, I'm very, very excited about that. Uh, we started with uh, the original Gigantic, uh, which came out about six years ago by now. The project is actually about bringing it back to life, relaunching it. The first step is learn the game in and out, so that you know exactly what you have to keep in the game because that is what the players love. But we're also adding a ton of new features, new maps, custom games, rush mode. We've revamped the entire tutorials. Quality of life improvements, improvements to matchmaking. The AI bots are more similar to real players nowadays. We added crossplay on all platforms. I think we covered all platforms by now, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, we have uh, had a couple of tests uh, where we jump in with a PlayStation, with an Xbox, a Steam Arc Epic. When you buy the game, we wanted to make sure you buy the full game and you get everything in the game. So no microtransactions, all characters, all cosmetics, everything. You can just unlock by playing the game. With Rush Mode, we focused on the moment-to-moment -moment gameplay. As you go into the match, there's no setup time or, or creature summoning required. You just immediately go to the points, fight for them, or you start flanking the enemy points, try to immediately disrupt them there. Because of that, it's more action-packed, shorter matches, and at the same time, less for new players to learn, so also more approachable. What stood out to me in the original game was the, the large roster of characters and how unique and diverse the entire roster was. Not just in the amazing character design, but also in each character having their own unique playstyle that through the upgrades you could even customize more to also fit your playstyle best. We're actually bringing all heroes back, all uh, 23 of them, and we are actually adding some that were uh, only just in development uh, first time around. My favorite hero would be the new hero that's added to the game, Kajir. This, this character is so incredibly cool, very slick, very sneaky, has great abilities. Kajir is a combination between a snake and a cat. So he has these amazing animations where he does these like, very snake-like motions and while still keeping the cat-like agility as he is moving around. For Roland specifically, the core of the bounty hunter gameplay fantasy, the experience, and we built on top of that tweaking what needed tweaking and finishing up the character. We've made him uh, this explorer with a shotgun walks around, likes to shoot things on close range and also has a grapple hook to pull him around the map. One of the most requested features from the community has always been ranked mode, and I'm excited to tell you that we're going to be bringing that in post-launch content. To be honest, without the fans, the game wouldn't have come back. Currently, they have no idea that we're working on this game, and we still peek on their, their forums, on their reddits, we go look, and it is so much fun to, to see them ask for the game and, and do these things with, without any knowledge of what's going on. So we're very excited to bring it back to them. We are super curious to see their reaction. But in the meantime, we're, we're sh among the developers, we're sharing a lot of their interactions as, as we find them. I really hope that they uh, enjoy this new game, the new Rampage Edition, that it's everything they've ever dreamed of that it would be. And I just want to thank them for their endless support because the reason we're doing this is because of you guys. Gigantic is back and we hope to see you on the airship. It has been amazing to see all your support behind the scenes on Reddit, uh, on the internet, and uh, this one is for you.